this video we'll be going over the different driving modes of the Mars Rover and the purpose of each one. The first mode is manual mode. In manual mode we use an IR remote to control the direction of the robot. We can use this mode to maneuver the robot to a specific place on the planet so it can collect data. It is very easy to use, however the only downside is that we cannot maneuver the robot from a long distance away. To move the rover forward, we press number 2 on the remote. To move it back, we press number 8. To turn left, we press number 4. To turn right, we press number 6. And to stop, we press number 5. The next mode is autonomous mode. In autonomous mode, the rover uses an ultrasonic sensor to calculate its distance from an object. If it senses an object within 8 centimeters, it backs up and turns to the right. We can use this when we want the rover to roam around and collect data randomly. The last mode is line tracking mode. The rover uses light sensors at the bottom of the robot to detect where the line is. Here is an example of the line tracking mode. We can use line tracking mode if we want the rover to follow a certain route on the planet. The LCD screen displays four pieces of information, distance, velocity, temperature, and humidity. In this video, you can see how the rover updates its distance from an object in real time. This data is helpful for finding more about the planet's surface. Our rover is meant to replicate the Mars Pathfinder launched in 1996, and it displays the same information as the Mars Pathfinder. 